click on the uh, tool icon and then um, options go to under the hood and network change proxy settings then settings and let me go ahead and type this IP address as again this is going to be our port so I'm 3128 so I'm gonna write it as a port 3128 make sure that over here after the last number of the IP there is no dots or anything else click OK OK and let 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 me go ahead and uh, what is my IP address dot com and check the IP address and here we go now the page is loading means that that we have the web browsing capabilities and currently my IP address is my proxy server address means that uh, nobody on the internet will know my real IP address it will show them this IP address which is my proxy which is fine with me because I don't care who are, uh, this IP address I just care about my IP address and those people they just giving that IP address for free to use that company so I can hide my IP address okay so it's working let me go ahead and demonstrate you one more and we're gonna uh, switch to Firefox okay let me go ahead and try this one right here and as again this is going to be my IP 213.234.22.62 and this is going to be my port 8080 please watch this video in a full HD 720p in the YouTube for the best quality again I'm gonna click that tool icon gonna to go to options uh, select the under the hood switch to network change proxy settings land settings and uh, check the bar with the proxy server and paste my IP and 8080 is my port this guy is my port so I'm going to delete it over here and type it over here we click OK and click OK and I'm going to go to what is my IP address.com or just refresh reload the page and let's see what is our IP address it's loading I can tell there as again this proxy will be slow so if I'm not going to be satisfied with the speed of the loading time, go ahead and to that list and switch to a different uh, IP address of the proxy. As again, you can see my IP address now is different and it's located in Russia. So it's pretty, um, you know, it's good. If it's in Russia, I'm, you know, it's, it's all good. So it's not where I am right now. So I'm satisfied. So here we go. This is what the second example how to set the proxy IP address into your Google Chrome. Okay? Let me go ahead and uh, show you how to set your IP uh, proxy IP address into the Firefox browser. Oh yeah, and after you're done with using your proxy, always make sure to disable it. Otherwise, if this proxy will not be able, um, if, if, if it's not going to be available in the next day, your internet will get errors, 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 web browser. And uh, if you will, uh, you know, if you will forget that you set your proxy, you probably will think it's your internet. So, um let me go ahead and show you how to uh, reset the proxy after you're done using it uh, with your Google Chrome. It's going to be the same thing in the Internet Explorer. You need to go ahead and uh, options and um, under the hood, change proxy settings, land settings. Same thing in the Internet Explorer. All what you need to do, you need to uncheck use a proxy server for your LAN and click OK 
and basically it's not going to use that proxy server again so because you know it's handy to do it after you're done uh, web browsing with that proxy because if you will forget to uncheck it in the future you might forget that you set the proxy and you will think oh I have the, my internet um, getting some problems oh my you know what's going on with my modem and stuff like this if you don't wanna get into the confusions always after you're done using the proxy and check it the same thing will uh, work with Internet Explorer load the uh, menu will you uh, uh, load the menu when you set the proxy and then check the proxy okay let me go ahead and show you how to how to uh, make it work in Firefox as again in Firefox we're going to go to the digital cybersoft.com website it's gonna load and uh, then it's gonna give us click here to get a list free fast proxies we're gonna get click it and get it it's going to give us some 24 working proxies found for today this list refreshing every day not necessary as again like I told you in pre in previously in this video that every single proxy will work for you some of those proxy will have the uh, not the full uh, web browsing capabilities um, some will be slow some will be fast some will be in Russia some will be in United States some will be in Canada or Japan it's up for your needs what you're looking for so just you know use this list and get the your needs the best speed and the best website browsing capabilities some of those proxy may have the YouTube blocked or uh, Yahoo blocked etc or Google blocked so go ahead and find the friendly proxy for you that uh, serve your needs to um, uh, for your web browsing capabilities needs for your web browsing needs okay in Firefox you need to go to tools before I'm gonna go to tools I'm going to go ahead and select the second proxy as again uh, the second proxy IP and as again this is your main IP 1218.92.0.38 and 8080 will be your port okay I'm gonna select the whole deal click copy and as again it doesn't matter what browser you're setting your proxy always before setting your uh, proxy check your IP go to what is my IP address dot com and check your IP address and then check it after you set the proxy and compare them if IP different then means that you're fine and usually IP after you set the proxy should match the proxy exactly like should match this 218.92.0.38 main IP address okay I'm gonna go tools options then over here I'm gonna go to advanced advanced but keep in mind that it, it possibilities I'm using the Firefox 4 right now but possibilities that in newer version of the Firefox their uh, graphic user interface will be changed and menus will be changed as again but no matter what will be changed you got the concept all what you're looking for you're looking for networking and the for proxy uh, settings and then that proxy settings you're looking where you're going to type the IP and the port okay I'm going to go to advance then it's going to say connection settings click in here and then Firefox is a little bit tricky because they're giving you abilities of some other network features so it has more boxes uh, some people it may got a little bit confused by that but don't get confused just watch my video you're gonna go to manual proxy configuration and then the HTTP proxy means that that proxy uh, supports the HTTP um, protocol we're gonna type here our IP we're gonna delete 8080 like so our main IP and type 8080 over here because like I told you it is a port 
I'm going to click OK. Now I'm going to go ahead and test that. I'm going to click OK over here. And I'm going to test it. I'm going to type what is my IP address. Here we go. China. So you got an idea and it's perfectly IP as in our list that we select only without the port which is fine. It's main IP over here. The rest is the port like I told you. Here we go. China. Let's go ahead and select the other IP. Let's go ahead and select this IP right here. I'm going to show you one more and we're about to be done. Go to tools, options, advanced, settings, and I'm going to go and paste my IP. And this is my main IP and this is going to be the port 8080. So the same port, so I'm going to just keep it 8080, click OK, OK, and refresh the page or reload. Here we, here we go. Australia. So you got an idea. And the IP is matching our IP over here. It's not showing the port though, which is fine. As you can see. Okay, so you got a perfect idea how to set the proxy IP address in the Firefox, proxy IP address in uh, Internet Explorer, proxy IP address in the Google Chrome. So you got the perfect idea how to set the proxy IP address on a, in the major browsers today on a PC. Use the same techniques to set it for the Macintosh and for the mobile devices. But keep in mind that some proxies will not support the mobile devices. So you got to find the proxy that will. Okay, I'm done using my proxy. So what I'm going to do, like I told you, keep it as a habit. Tools, option, and make it disabled. I'm going to go to advanced, settings, and over here, if I don't want to use no proxy, I'm going to select no proxy. I'm going to click OK, OK. So now I'm done to use it, my proxy. I'm, gonna, I'm ready to go. Always keep it as a habit because if you're going to forget this proxy server will be unavailable tomorrow, you will think that you're having problems with your internet connection. But it's not. It's just calling the proxy that is not available. Okay? Well, thank you so much for watching. I think we're done. Um, as a conclusion, today you just learned how to set the proxy server IP address and how to browse anonymously. Uh, on the internet and uh, please thumbs up this video will be split into multiple parts on YouTube and probably on, in, on, on my two channels please thumbs up for both parts I will appreciate that so more people can see it if you like to learn in uh, about IT from a professional please subscribe to this channel thank you so much my name is Alexander Moroz and by the way, I'm using today Moroz video capture software, little program that was developed by me to capture the desktop tutorials like this one and to capture the gameplay videos while you're playing your favorite games on a PC. And uh, that software was developed by me as again Moroz video capture. Uh, just Google for it. Thank you so much, guys. And I will see you uh, in next tutorial. Till the next time, bye-bye. Take care.